Some of you, you're so small-minded that you're like, well, I don't understand. That doesn't work in my job. This is your life. This isn't a job. This is your life. Your life is to become a sales expert. Your job is to become a closing expert. Your job is to understand how all people work. Some of you in here, when I talk about other industries today, I'll lose you because you don't want to listen to that. You want to listen to what you want to listen to. Can I explain this to you? People are fucking people. They're people. Do you guys want to only sell people that's like you? Okay. If I was a fitness guy and I was once 450 pounds and then now I'm 300 pounds, I lost 150 pounds. When I talk to a skinny guy that wants to gain muscle, or I talk to a mom or someone else, I don't know how to talk to those people because I'm always like, I need to find the big guy that wants to lose 150 pounds. I can only close people that had a life transformation like I had. If you guys will listen, you'll understand how to give everybody a life transformation and a new life or help them with your product or help anybody with any product. And you'll understand that really what you guys all do is really all the same. Like competence creates confidence. I need everybody to understand something. If you don't feel like you're good at something, you're not gonna be good at it. Like you're, you're totally discouraged. Does that make sense? Like this is a real deal. Like when a guy doesn't think he's gonna perform good, he doesn't perform good. His body doesn't even operate. He can't because his mind tells him he's not worth it. He's not good at it. If I can just learn how to believe in myself, you'll never out earn your own self-worth. And you guys may not think that this matters, just stay the same. That's what they want you to do. Do you guys get it? You know what the world wants you to do? Conform and consume and produce. Be in a fucking cycle. Conform to the world, consume and produce and do like fucking this. Am I right? In case anybody's interested in this fucking grand new life and the ride of a lifetime and fucking millions of dollars. Who's in on that? Yeah. Don't fucking lie to me. It's not like they're speaking with their mouth. They speak with their heart. What does that mean? They believe. They believe. That's why when they talk, it's just not bland, dead, dead Bob words. They're words that actually have passion tied to them. Write this down. My words must have passion tied to it. God made people for communion. People, they need you to show up and believe again and have passion with your words. And if you can do this, you'll be rich in your heart because your customers will love you, but you'll also be rich in your wallet. Why? Because when you're the best at what you do, it pays differently. He said a new tone. Everybody say new tone. When you decide to change your life, and you decide you wanna change your behaviors, you're gonna to have to start walking around with a new tone too. Do you hear me? Hey, this guy, hey, let's play around. Let's, hey, I don't like that, dude. I don't like it. I wanna win. Man, what, damn, dude, I didn't know that bothered you. Yeah, it does. So like, let's get back to work. People are like, I don't like that guy anymore. Cause you got a new tone. I'm, I'm not telling you to be a d I'm trying to tell you when you decide to go to new levels, somebody has to draw a line in the sand and say, hey, I love you, but loyalty is over here. It's like salt and pepper. Does that make sense? Like me and you could be friends, but then we also have business. Does that make sense? Salt and pepper. There has to be a time that she's like, this is a pepper conversation. This isn't salt and pepper. Cause sometimes I'll tell you like, hey man, I appreciate you. I want you to, I want you to do great, but you're, you're not working hard. You're distracted at work and I love you, man. And I'll do whatever you need me to do to help you. But dude, if you don't start caring more, we're gonna have to change something, like seriously. So what's it gonna be? Are you gonna commit and go all in with us or not? Because I need to know. We need to have these hard conversations with leaders, with salespeople, with finance, with everybody. Why? Because everybody needs to get on the same page.